Welcome back to another video gamers. So in the last video, I built two things for my animals. I built the, uh, wait, we can't look at it from this angle. We can't look at it from the sides, okay? We can only look at it from this angle because from the other sides, it looks shit, basically. It took me ages to find this pink wool and I still need some for this side. However, people have said that I can use shears on the pink sheep. So let's go do that real quick. I'm not gonna do it on all of them just in case it doesn't grow back for some reason. Wait, is that it? You get one? You get one. You get one pink wool. I mean, it beats looking for pink flowers. Anyway, I built that in the last video, um, and I built this for my turtles. Both designs were copied from my subreddit. Oh, and the turtle is trying to escape yet again. Come on, mate. This ain't prison break. Get back in. I haven't built the place for my pandas or skeleton horses yet, but I'm gonna build that soon. But as you can see, the village is no longer as much of a mess. We've got all the animals in the village now, except for one. Dolphins. That is the only animal in the game that I don't have in my village. Well, there's different animals and stuff, but like main animals. I built this for them. I need to get rid of the glowstone because it doesn't do shit underwater. And if you remember, if you saw the video that I did, maybe probably about four weeks ago now, I actually did get a dolphin into my village. I found out when I made that video that you can't just put them on a lead and then bring them back like you can in the Java version. In bedrock, it's a lot harder. You can't take them on leads. They die after like five seconds of being out of the water. So I had to think of something different. And I basically built a dolphin trafficking system from the ocean to my village. And I proved that it works because I did get one in here. Only problem is it took fucking years. My problem is that it gradually gets steeper and the dolphins just will not go up one block. They will, but it's just incredibly difficult to make them do it. So I've got to build a new dolphin trafficking system that goes directly into the tank. And if you haven't seen that video, you might be wondering where the first dolphin went. I don't know. I just, I went to get a second dolphin and then when I gave up because it was taking too long, I came back and he was gone. I thought he despawned, but people told me that he jumped out and then died outside of the pool and I can see that being true so I'm going to have to put an extra layer of glass on top of this so let's go get some sand before I run all the way over there I that reminded me of something else I need to make fireworks that also reminds me to I need to make a librarian villager so I can get a mending book apparently if you put mending on an elytra it'll just never break one gunpowder and one paper okay do I have any of those things gunpowder Okay, I've got 38. Do I have any more? Yep, I've got nine there. Oh, I've already got my sand. I don't need to go and get that after all. I don't have any paper though, and I need some sugar canes for that. Okay, so you can get sugar cane seeds from apparently near water. I'm gonna make a sugar cane farm. That way I never run out of paper. There it is. Yep, that's it. Right, well, I only got I only got three from that, and there's no more around the area. So let's go to the ocean. Right, I can't see any sugar cane whatsoever. I have some over there. Well, that'll have to do for now. Oh yeah, let's try and get to level 32 because I need to enchant my shovel with efficiency four. Where are the firework? There they are, firework rockets. Let's put the elytra on and test these bad boys out. I actually have no idea how to use these things. Oh, you need to jump off something, don't you? I like how the uh, wandering trader is praising the holy llama. There we go. Oh, that's brilliant. Oh my god, look at this. This is crazy. Look how fast you can go. Uh, okay, and then it wears off. Well, I guess I could always, like, make some stairs going up to my village wall. And then I can have my village wall. Or maybe I could, like, yeah, that's a better idea. If I make, like, a little thing on top of my house where I can get up to the roof, then if I want to go anywhere, I can just jump out of my house. Let's put some ladders down, and then we'll go get some dolphins soon. But like I said before, what I want to do is enchant this. Nice to see the family's doing good. Silk Touch- wait, hold on. Silk Touch 1, level 16. Silk Touch 1, level 30. What's the difference? Well, I don't want any of them. So I am guess I'm, I'll just enchant a regular diamond pickaxe just to refresh the enchantments. Now let's put the shovel back in. Ah, efficiency three. That's what I'm talking about. And the best thing about enchanting is it doesn't really get rid of any of your levels. Like I'm still level, t I was level 27, I think, or 28. I'm level 25 now and I just enchanted two things. Well, now we can go to the ocean and build the dolphin tunnel. Oh, that is just amazing. I'm never going to get tired of this. That's for sure. Well, stop. Got to get used to flying it, but I'm going to build a tunnel from here because this is the dolphin trap. So it's going to be singular. It's going to be one. Oh, for fuck's sake. This is why I didn't want to go across an ocean, but to be honest, I have no choice. It's going to go straight forward and then right. Wow, I'm about to die. Holy shit. 
I'm gonna build it under the water because that way I don't have to fill it up with water myself. Right, there we go. So that's the bit across the water. And then we're gonna build a little wall so it can't escape. This is basically a tutorial. This is for people who don't know how to transport dolphins. I might be a beginner, but I can guarantee that not everyone has tried to get dolphins into their village before. I have experience. Look at this. I just got almost three stacks in about 10 seconds. Jesus, this thing is mental. That'll do for now. So as you can see, there's only one pathway for the dolphin to go through. He cannot go up. He cannot go sideways or anything. And when we get to this bit, this is why I got my efficiency four, because I'm going to have to go, I'm going to have to dig a straight pathway through all of this. Someone just threw a trident at me. Look, all I'm trying to do is rob dolphins from the ocean. I'd appreciate it if you didn't get in my way of doing that. Yeah, I'm gonna have to dig a straight line because the main problem with the other one is that it required them to go up blocks. I mean, it ain't too bad because all I have to do is dig in a straight line really and then fill it with water. Let's just go up to the surface, check where I'm at. Ah, right, I've gone too far actually. So that means if we go this way, Let's just block that bit up. And although we're going to be underground, I've got to figure out some way to get the dolphin into the pool. It's actually not taking as long as I thought because, well, efficiency four is an absolute godsend. Let's go check up now. We should, yeah, we're definitely going to be in the village. Okay, ah, yes, we're, okay, this is great, actually. Right, this is what I've got in mind. We're going to have to try something. Let's just go a couple blocks to the right then. I don't think this is going to work, you know, because, well, the water's fucking pushing him the other way. My goal is to get him to, like, just rise up. Don't have any other ideas. Right, well, before we actually try this, we've got to do two things. Fill it up with water and then add some more glass to the top of it. Let's just check up on the pink sheep. Make sure he's actually, uh... Oh, he has. He's grown it back. Why am I trying to shear him with a fucking bucket? Oh, we got two from that. Three! Even better! That's coming along nicely. Should have probably slept before coming over here, but I'll just have to deal with the enemies. This is where we're going to need to do some work. So let's uh, go in here and we'll make the infinite supply there. There we go. Infinite. So we've got to make this with no current. As you can see, there's a current and that is unacceptable. I think I'm doing all this just for it to not work. I, I really have a feeling that the dolphin just will not flow up to the top. God damn it. Why can you do it in Java, but you can't do it in bedrock? It's like, it's easy in that version. You just put them on a lead and then you can jump off some scaffolding and fly back on an elytra. But at least this water's working the way I wanted it to do. In the previous dolphin system, wait, we've got to think of a name for it. Let's call it the Dolphin Stealer 3000. But for for sure, I can call it the DS3. In the previous DS3, one thing I had trouble with is making water like this. I'm going to make a new infinite water supply now because I'm getting quite far away from this one. But yeah, you know what they should add into this game? They should add grillers into the game. Silverback grillers found in jungles and you can find them walking around with uh, six baby grillers following them. Maybe not six, but like four or five, I'd say, just so it's like real life, you know? And if you get too close to them too fast, they'll attack you because the silverback gorilla is obviously protective, but you can gain their trust. And if a zombie attacks you or something after they trust you, the gorillas will then attack the zombies that attack you and stuff. The silverback gorilla can be as big as an iron golem. Come on, that would be cool. Another thing that I wanted in the game that I found out was actually a mod when I searched up for it is being able to go into space. Like imagine that, there's like a huge space agency building or something, only one in this infinite world and you can get a map to it and you can trade with the villagers there to get like space rockets and astronaut suits, fuel for the rocket, oxygen tanks, whatever else you need to go into space. Then when you're in space, you can land on different planets and on the different planets, there's different enemies like aliens and stuff. You can explore caves and stuff and find new blocks and materials and stuff to make new things. If they ever run out of ideas completely for this game, I think they should do that. Anyway, we've almost done the water tunnel. I mean, I've got no doubt that the dolphin will be able to get down here. It's just, I don't think he'll be able to actually get into the pool. There they are. Okay. Yes, in here. There we go. We've got two dolphins in the trap. It's not really a trap. I mean, that kind of sounds mean. Wait, why aren't they moving? Don't tell me they can't go down singular fucking... Ah, they can. I can... Okay, well, I can manually push them if this ever happens. Okay, now if they could go around the corner... Yeah, there we go. Ah, there we go. He's going this way now. Well, even if this method doesn't work, it's still the best method at transporting them because I can get him from the ocean all the way into the village. I just can't get him onto the surface. If you could go that way. 
please just rise up. Yeah, 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 like that, just like that, just like that, go! He's, oh my god, it fucking worked. Shit, but I haven't put the glass down. Quick, quick, just for now. Before he jumps out, before he jumps out, before he jumps out. Shit, I'm out, I'm out! Oh my god, we've done it. There's a dolphin in the tank. Uh, I don't like how the water is free-flowing like that. It's really annoying, actually. I mean, he looks like he can still swim around the whole place, which is good. But it just doesn't look right. Now let's go and make some glass. And then we'll go get some more dolphins. Holy shit, the Dolphin Stealer 3000 version 2 actually works. I'm actually so happy about that. Um, let's... Do we have any more sand? I think we do. Yeah, yeah, I've got to fix the water current. I just have no idea how to do it. What we should do in the meantime is name the dolphin. I've got six name tags. I'm gonna go with a very unique and complex and name that no one really goes for. Ben. Let's call him Benjamin. Benjamin the dolphin. Benjamin. Now he won't despawn and he should be here forever. And look, the villagers are actually coming over to check it out. They never fucking come down here. But now there's a dolphin here, they're coming. I don't think we're gonna have enough sand, you know. Oh, we, oh, yes, we are. We've got 64 here. All right, we've got 34. I don't... Cooking sand takes years. And I can finally get rid of this shit. In fact, I'm doing that before I even put the glass down. Oh, look, we can get some more of the glass back. Only a few, but it all adds up. I hate this being in the village. I've wanted to get rid of it ever since I put it down. But I just kept it just in case I needed to use it again. But now we don't need to because we've got an underground tunnel that is always there. It's looking good, though. This is what it's going to look like. I'll get rid of the glowstone as well when I'm there. Okay, how much more sand is done? 23. Wait, do I not have any glass? Oh my god, I've got 58 glass and I didn't even notice. Don't worry, Benjamin, I'm going to be bringing your dolphin friend soon. We're going to have enough to finish it, I think. As you know, probably not. Oh no, we did. We had enough to finish it. Okay. There we go. See, look, glowstone underwater doesn't do shit. Um, I thought it'd make it look really cool at night, but it doesn't. Okay, Benjamin, I'll be back next time with your brother. There he is. Okay, well, this is an easier way of doing it. You've just got to get their attention and then they'll follow you for a bit. And then you just block it off again. You can do this. See your dolphin brother once again. We've done it. Look at that. Look how easy it is. I honestly am shocked by how easy it is to get them into it. Because I tried to do something similar with the old dolphin tunnel. And it just it didn't work at all. Let's try and use the elytra off of here. Oh, that's great. Let's just take a look. Yep, there they are. I've got to decorate the floor of it. I want to put like, I know you can get colorful sea plants, so I want to get them. Before I end the video, my goal is to just get at least maybe two more. They should be just here. Oh, that almost ended very badly. Let's just pretend that didn't happen. Okay, there's two over there. Come on in, friends. This way, this way, this way. Follow me, follow me. Go up, just like he's doing. Yes. Oh, no, you're so close. No, 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 no. Come on, you're so close. Come on, buddy, you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. No! <laughs> Done it. Four dolphins in the village now, and I'm happy with that for the video. I will get more in the future. Actually, before I end the video, I'm actually going to use my rockets and go into the ocean somewhere. I want to get some sea plants. Right, let's get a potion of water breathing. Um, Three minutes. I'll take two, though. They're not that difficult to make. I just realized that these fireworks are great because I can go to the end again to get more elytras, but I don't need to walk and I don't need to run across bridges or anything. I can just use fireworks. Okay, so I'm just going to... I don't know where I'm actually going to go. Jesus Christ, this thing is OP. I love it. Not everywhere in the sea has the sea blocks I'm looking for. Right, I can't see any at all. There's some more sugarcane over here. So I might as well get all that while I'm here. Do I still have my gunpowder on me? Yes, so I can actually make more. Wonder how, ma how many we'll be able to make with this. Oh, 41. Still can't see any sea blocks. What the hell is this? Underwater pillager tower? Right, I didn't think it would be this difficult to find what I'm looking for. I don't even know what I'm actually looking for. Like, I don't know the name of it. Just those underwater sea plant things that are colourful. You know, the pink and green and yellow things. Where are they at? And some more sugar cane over there. And some over here as well. Right, I'm going back home because I can't find that. Whoa! We should start to see some... Yeah, there's the ocean monument. We're almost there now. It's not working. Oh no, is it broken? Oh, I think it, yeah, yeah, it's dead. Well, 
We don't have to swim that far back, but I need mending on it ASAP. I think you can get it from librarians. Need to make a librarian. All I think all you need for that is one of those library stand things. But, but then even when I get a librarian, I'm still gonna have to trade with him a bunch of different shit until I can get the mending book. But it's the only way of doing it. Actually, no, it's not actually. You can get it from fishing too, but I'm not gonna sit there fishing when it's not even a guarantee that I'm gonna get it. With the librarian, you know it's a guarantee that you will get it. You've just gotta trade some stuff. Um, so maybe in the next video, that's what we'll do. Trade with a librarian and get him whatever he needs. Let's make some more paper and then let's make 30 more rockets. Look at that, I've got over a stack now. I've got almost two stacks of rockets. I'm rich in rockets now. So we can make a lectern here. So I'll take that and I'll go and place that down for a villager. Nice. Let's just make sure the dolphins are still here because I did go quite far out. Yeah, they are. They're all here. Like I said, I do need to uh, figure out how I can make the water flow nicely. But I'll do that another time. Are you still praising the Holy Llama? So I'm just going to place this in the work building. I'll put it there. Hopefully, by the next video, we'll have a librarian in the village. Let's just get the shears back out and get a bit more pink wool. How much did we get then? Just one. That's fine because I am aware that it grows back now. So I'll do that for the others as well. This is now complete. Yeah, villager, do you like it? I do. Oh, it's already grown back. That's an infinite supply of pink wool. I guess I'll feed you all for the hard work that you've done. Maybe they'll make another one. Yep, there he is. But yeah, that's going to be it for this video, guys. All I wanted to do was get the uh, dolphins in the village. And we did it! After a failed attempt a few weeks ago, well, a successful attempt that ended up in a failure, we've actually done it. We've now got dolphins in the village. We've got all the animals that we want in the village, I think, until they add gorillas to the game. So like I said, in the next video, I'm going to work on getting mending, and that way I can fly forever. Wait, is that him? Oh, we've done it. We've already got a librarian now. Okay, so we've got to trade some... Emeralds, that's gonna be difficult to get. I'll work on that in the next video. But yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Definitely subscribe if you're new here. And I'll see you all in the next video.